these hills are young. They're going up now. They're being squeezed between the Pacific Plate and the, re and the rest of North American Plate, and they're wrinkling up. So here, the angle of this, which is steeper than you would find those rocks in a natural stream deposit, tells you that these hills have been tilted up and folded. Notice the size and the roundness of those pebbles. They've been tumbled and rounded in the stream. What's under them? Sand. 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 Yeah. A sandstone. That's right. And that tells you, uh, and what's below the sandstone? Can you see it? Here. More coarser cobbles. And that's very typical if you think of a stream, if you think of Strawberry Creek the way it was before we built Berkeley, right? When it was rolling down from these hills to the, to the bay. It, when there's a big rainstorm, higher energy, bigger rocks carried down, tumbling, tumbling, getting round. The pebbly, coarser stuff is called a conglomerate. That's a rock the name of a sedimentary rock. Not this particular conglomerate is the Orinda Formation conglomerate. We've gone from the Moraga or Grizzly Peak Volcanics basalt into the Orinda Formation. We're going to a better stop, but look at the rocks along here. This is really, you can see the layers, oh, but it's all tilted, so it's wow. up and down. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is a different rock than what we've seen uh, so far. This church is a marine sedimentary rock. It's 14 to 16 million years old, and you have crossed the contact the, between the terrestrial stream deposits of the Orinda Formation into the older marine sediments. When you look at this rock under the microscope, it is made up almost entirely of the skeletons of single-celled plants and animals called diatoms and radiolaria and related little single-celled organisms. That's the incredible story. I, I, this is just, a, a, just a, such a neat area uh, because of this wonderful story it tells. And you can go back further in time. All you have to do is cross the bay and uh, start looking at the geology of marine.